that was the early alarm, mate. It was good for us. What about for you? Yeah, it was a nice early start today, but um, look, we couldn't have asked for a better start to 2016 from the playing group. I think um, uh, today we had uh, nearly most of the group run PBs, and uh, it's probably the best I've seen the, the group run. Um, certainly a 3K in, in, in my time here. What does that mean in uh, January, the early weeks of January? Oh, look, I think we've, we've set a high expectation of the group, and uh, certainly, um, you know, we know that you know our strength is our running, and, and we build our game around that, and, and certainly that's gone to another level so far. And I'm just proud of the guys of the way they've come back from a, from a Christmas break and uh, willing to come back and work hard and uh, you know and work hard over the Christmas break. So keeping off the beer in the Christmas pudding? Yeah, well, it looks like most of the guys did, and oh, we got we got skin folds to go, so we'll soon find out how many how many guys had a bit of pudding. But no, look, it was just a, a great chance for our guys to to get back and. Uh, spent a bit of time with their family, but they went back and, and still trained just as hard as they have been before Christmas, so it was a, as a credit to them. It's Who pretty was decent. the call to say that they come back in as good a shape as you can remember during your time? How do you sort of gauge that? Oh, look, uh, it comes down to the times they've been running, and, and I mean, if we've, won, we've run nearly three calls a group, we've run a PB, then they've certainly put in so much work, and, um, you know, to go, it's quite easy to go back home or, or where you're from and, um, you know, relax and, and, you know, have a few beers and take it easy. And I'm sure the guys relaxed and enjoyed themselves, but they've, they've certainly worked hard and uh, wanted to come back in really good shape. Did you anticipate that? Well, we had a chat before um, we went on break and, and, and we just spoke about the expectation we've set on ourselves before Christmas and, and we want to come back in really good shape. And uh, look, I probably didn't uh, expect the group to come back in this great a, great a shape and uh, to have you know, three quarters of group run a PB is just outstanding. What does it say about the group on the whole that they can go away and then just come back and be in as good shape as you say? I think it shows that they're, uh, you know, how much last year hurt and uh, how much they're willing to improve. and and what we want from uh, from each other this year and, and what we expect from each other and, and certainly the standards there and we don't need to, um, you know, we don't have to be around each other and push each other. There's certainly uh, that internal drive in each, in each player and, and that's that's been shown today. Chase Mead looked like he was running really, really good times so I think he basically led the led that first group in it. So. Yeah, Jake has been, um, you know, outstanding uh, this pre-season so far and, uh, you know, he put in a lot of work before Christmas and. Uh, you know, he, he again today uh, showed that he had a, a fantastic break and uh, wanted to come back and, and really prove a point and, and probably be, uh, you know, in front leading the way in that small forward group in, in, um, at the club and, and certainly he's done that. That was, a small, issue for, sorry, that was a small issue for him uh, a couple of years ago. I think he came back and he wasn't quite in the sort of nick everyone would have liked him to be. Yeah, it was. And, um, you know, we, we sat down with Jake and, and had a chat about that and, and certainly, um, you know, since then it, it's changed so much. and. Uh, you know, he's willing to, to put the team first and really improve and, and uh, just want to make a stand and, and, and uh, really cement his spot in the group and he's, uh, he's taken a step forward today. Has sure. Sammy Colhoun taken the mantle from Kane Corns? <laughs> uh, well, he's he's uh, not far off, Sammy. He ran pretty well today and uh, I'm not sure of the exact time, but, uh, you know, again, he's, I think he won it again today. and um, Yeah, so hopefully one day he can knock Kane off because he's, he's been up there too long. Is anything awry with your shoulder, mate? You've lots of strapping there. Anything go on, or it's okay? No, nah, no, nah, shoulder's fine. That's just all precautionary still from the surgery, and uh, I'll probably strap it for the majority of the year. Just to uh, it makes me look a little bit tougher as well than I am. So I uh, just keep it on for majority of the year. Any New Year's resolutions? Uh, any New Year's resolutions? Um, not really. I don't really tend to set too many. I just uh, hope for a nice Christmas present or a New Year's present from uh, late in October would be nice or early October. So we'll, we'll wait and see for that one. What are your early expectations for the season this year? Oh, look, um, I think for us, we, we 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 even just had a chat about it. Then we just we just want to make sure our efforts there, and I think that's something that uh, you know we're really going to focus on is um, you know making sure the effort and, and the methods really there, and look, the results will take care of itself from that. And we know we've got an outstanding group, and um, you know if, if we put it all together and, and, and work hard as a group, and, and we've shown it today that we're capable of doing it, uh, then you know results will take care of itself from that.